Hello my beautiful Pisces and welcome to Let Every Need Tarot. Today I'm going to be doing a love reading. We're going to be seeing what is coming towards you. Thank you all so much for all your likes, your shares, your comments and your subscribes. I really do appreciate it. If any of you would like to book a personal reading, all info on how to do so is in the description box below. Please sure, please make sure, sorry, that you are um reading all the information provided before booking and make sure you book with me first don't just send random payments um and you need to make sure that you're reading the information that i send you in terms of how to pay because there are no refunds if you make a mistake um please do remem remember remember look wet sorry <laughs> Please do remember that the energies can go vice versa in the readings and just take what resonates, okay? And switch the gender, switch the roles, do whatever it is that you gotta do, okay? So, my beautiful Pisces, let's get into it, okay? I've already cleansed the cards and asked the relevant questions. So, the overall energy and love, we've got take off the masks. And at the bottom of the deck, we've got young natural love. Well, that's really beautiful. So for some of you, there may be somebody that may want to reveal their feelings to you, okay? Somebody may be, um, they may not be sure whether or not you're going to be able to take the real them or love them for the real them. For some of you, somebody loves you for who you truly are. So um, there could have been a person that's used to, I don't know, like that kind of bad bitch energy or the fakeness, you know, the weave and the makeup and all that. But they're looking for something different. They're looking for something natural and that's what they see within you, okay? Um, also, for some of you, you may be realising that um you embracing your natural self is more attractive or it may change the type of people that are attracting themselves to you so for example you know like if you like if you have a different hairstyle for example or you dress a certain type of way there's a certain type of energy that is more drawn to you over than when you're than when you have a different appearance do you understand what i'm trying to say like it's kind of like if you walk outside looking like a tart, you're probably going to attract fuckboy energy. But if you go out looking like a queen or, you know, wearing something a bit more, you're going to attract a different type of energy, okay? So I feel like some of you could be realising that there may be something about yourself that you need to change um, in order for you to attract the correct partner, okay? And it's definitely working, okay? But let's just see, okay? Let's just see. But I do get the energy of, like, somebody could be watching you. Someone could maybe... Um, tired of seeing the same thing all the time but they see something natural and pure within you and that's very attracted to attractive to them so let's just see shall we so what is coming towards my beautiful um pisces in love okay i might have to do it down here what's coming towards my beautiful pisces in love okay this keeps wanting to come out. I am courageous. So for some of you, there could be a Leo that's coming towards you. This person uh, may feel like you're very um, confident, okay? That also might be a thing as well. It's kind of like this person thinks that you're confident in terms of being like being yourself not having to be like a clone of, or trying sorry to be like a clone of other people to try and get attention so you could be somebody who's quite quiet you may be like to yourself but you kind of your your energy is loud okay um there could be also somebody wanting to pluck up the courage to tell you how they feel or again this could be vice versa this could be how you're feeling towards somebody else okay but you definitely could be dealing with a leo does not have to be yeah look at the bottom of the deck we've got i am swept up in romance so somebody's definitely romantically attracted to you okay also it's saying not to be shy or somebody may like your um sassy nature there might be something about you that's very um again it could be your hair because you know leo's rule the main you know the hair the lioness type of energy okay we've got um i'm able to manifest my heart's desire so yeah for some of you like i said in the beginning like you may realize that maybe changing up your look changing up your style or changing up your mentality and your perspective um is what is going to draw the natural love um that is going to come towards you okay or somebody could be manifesting you okay Somebody could be scripting and saying, this is what I want, and you're the answer to their prayer. So this is really beautiful. For some of you, could be readers, okay? And somebody definitely could be watching you on a screen when you're doing readings, or you could be in love, or um, I just heard, like, I'm in a trance. You could be mesmerized by a reader, okay? Or somebody who's like a spiritual teacher or some kind of guru, okay? Or this person that is coming towards you is into the same things. Because obviously Pisces, you know, you, you are the high priestess. So you could be attracting um, somebody who is a high priest. Like someone who's into um, spirituality. They're into all that kind of stuff. And yeah, okay. 
and then we've got I am filled with creative ideas that wanted to come out okay so this is somebody that's definitely been thinking about you heavy again like I said someone is really much attracted to your hair okay this is somebody who's very very creative as well or you could be very creative the color pink is also very significant here as well I'm hearing pretty in pink so somebody likes when you wear pink or pink represents unconditional love as well as friendship. So I feel like somebody's looking for a lover and a friend. So this is really gorgeous energy. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have um, I am calm and relaxed. Okay, so again, I feel like it's just saying like, you don't really need to do anything in order for this energy to come in. Okay, also for some of you, there's somebody that could be um conflicted within their mind of how to speak to you, how to approach you. Okay, so they could be holding back, but I feel like it's just like, Something in them is firing up and they're like, I've got to say what I've got to say. Yeah, because underneath that we've got I am strong and fearless. So heavy um, Leo energy here. Also, there could be somebody that wants to fight for you or fight for this a connection. Okay. <clears throat> I also feel like there may be a calming energy that you have. Again, with that purity, that angelic, like somebody just may feel like that about you like somebody could just be um, themselves around you. Okay, there's no drama. There's no strife. So this is really, really beautiful energy. Or somebody may want to create peace with you. Okay, but let's just see. So this is for my beautiful um, Pisces. Please clarify, I am courageous. <clears throat> Please clarify, I am courageous. Gift and offers. Yeah, I told you. <laughs> yes. Somebody wants to offer you something, okay? They're just plucking up the courage gorgeous again some of you again you could be buying yourself things and changing up the way that you look or somebody wants to give you a gift or a present okay it could be even a thing where if you're currently in a relationship right now and then it's kind of like you're putting your makeup on they might just be like you don't even need makeup you know you look beautiful just the way you are baby i love to see your natural skin Ugh. you know <laughs> sorry i'm in a really giddy mood today okay but yeah definitely somebody um wanting to take you out or wanting to surprise you or again this could be something that you're manifesting that you're not realizing that's coming towards you but it is okay i'm hearing the power of belief as well so please clarify i'm able to manifest my heart's desires what is it that you guys are manifesting okay what's what's going on here it's just too many cords okay so we've got memories okay so again, this could be past energy as well. So somebody from the past could be quite nostalgic over you. They could be thinking, you know, ah, oh, do you know what? Like, I really had a pure love and, you know, I was too focused on the baddies and now I want a goodie or I want a really, okay? Or somebody may have reflected upon themselves and upon their own behavior. They may have realized that they were making, wearing a mask or they were like, um... I'm hearing concealed, like something was over their eyes. They couldn't see things clearly, so they had to go within with, with this card, okay? Also, again, somebody could be watching you on a screen, so they could be looking at your pictures or looking at your videos, okay? And I'm also hearing somebody could be using your picture to bring you towards them, okay? So you may want to be careful about that. Also, for some of you as well, I feel like this person feels like you kind of... um. You could have had a past life with this person and you've manifested, manifested them now into this life. Or you make somebody, you remind someone of their childhood. Okay, Queen B, yes, gorgeous energy, gorgeous. So this person sees you or this could be how you're seeing somebody or this could be who's coming towards you. But again, that lion, lion, lioness energy, okay? Somebody who's bold, who's out there, who's courageous, who's confident, who's sexy, okay? Somebody definitely admires you and puts you up on a pedestal here okay so this is gorgeous but i do feel like you're heavily on in somebody's thoughts right now i also feel like you're the queen of your field or the queen of whatever it is that you can do okay yeah we've got endings and um beginnings and underneath that we do have judgment and reoccurring thoughts i told you somebody is thinking about you heavy so this could be oh, love. Oh, i don't think they wanted me to tell you that gosh sorry about that guys okay so yeah so someone's all over the place <laughs> Okay, someone is all over the place. That's kind of what I got. I'm also hearing someone may want may um stumble upon their words, but yeah, underneath the endings we do have um judgment here. So somebody may want a second chance. 
okay also for some of you you may have ended something for some with somebody and now you've ended something you've ended the past you know you've realized that that wasn't really getting you know where you're dealing with fuck boy fuck girl energy and you've opened yourself up to a window of new opportunities so this new love is now coming towards you okay so you've had to end it but this person um can't let go okay or you could be dealing with a scorpio i'm hearing scorpio and leo mix or this person could have heavy scorpio or leo um placements okay so what is coming towards my beautiful pisces that was real quick sweet and sticky yes it says kind caring compassionate loving physical touch yeah so somebody definitely um wants to take you out they want to romance you, I'm hearing. Somebody wants to be chivalrous, kind and caring and, and, and really look after you. Also, this person sees that within you. So you may be somebody who like might have a bit of a mouth on you, but you've got a soft side with you as well. And that's kind of like that Leo Lioness energy, okay? You know, it's it's kind of like um people can misconstrue fire signs because they may see them as quite temperamental, but Leos especially have a really big heart. So that's really gorgeous, okay? But I feel like somebody wants to spoil you or somebody just thinks that you're really sweet. Okay, so that's really, really gorgeous. Please clarify memories. What is coming towards my beautiful Pisces? We've got Oshun, gorgeous with the sweet and sticky. So for some of you, you've got sweet, sticky waters, okay? I feel like this person may fantasize about making love to you. 11, 11 on the clock, as I said that, okay? Um, but yeah, like I said, someone is definitely looking at your pictures, okay? We've got... um sensuality self-love beauty water and fertility so somebody could be looking like god oh my god this person is just a dream i want them i need them this is really really beautiful energy okay someone sees you as, as just abundant be and beautiful empress vibes here okay gorgeous i feel like somebody just gets lost in a trance when they look at you okay yeah you could have a telepathic communi um connection with this person there definitely could be um trying to draw you in with the intuition chakra blue telepathy and perception card here please clarify queen b okay two cards but i'm going to take this one okay we've got do you remember memories past life karmic soulmates and reminiscing did i not just say do you remember the time i told you you bring this person back so some of you could be um, manifesting a partner. But again, like I said, at the bottom of the deck, we've got walk away here. It says um, leaving separations, ending in divorce. I said that some of you may need to leave somebody in order for, um, for something beautiful to come in. So you may have had to leave. Some of you could have got divorced by a particular person, okay? And even with the judgment card, that talks about answering your calling, okay? So somebody may want to call you because underneath that, we do have call here. It says communication news offers an excitement. There could be, you know, I'm, I'm hearing a little, lot of different scenarios, so take what's yours. But I do feel like somebody from the past has realized who you are and they want to reach out to you okay because they've seen that you're the purity within their life okay you could be really calm and manifesting um not being with this person for others of you you could have recently walked away from someone or you walked away from the past and because you've done that you've passed some sort of test and now something beautiful is about to come okay but um yeah because look underneath that is i want you back i told you somebody wants to um they want you back because now they understand your worth or they recognize Okay, for some of you, you may have had to walk away or to leave somebody for them to kind of really feel it. But I definitely feel like something beautiful is being manifested, okay? But yeah, someone definitely wants to reveal their true feelings here. But let's just see. Please clarify the first row what is coming towards my um, beautiful um, Pisces. We've got the King of Pentacles. Gorgeous energy here, okay? So this, again, this is somebody who wants to take care of you, who wants to provide for you. This could be somebody who has their own business, okay? Um... And they want to spoil you with gifts. This is somebody who's got money and someone who um, takes relationships very seriously. Now, if they're not somebody who's well off, they may just be very, very loyal because um, Earth, that represents loyalty, you know, stability. This is somebody who definitely wants to build. Like, he's got his coin here and he's um, he wants to invest in you. And his coin, you know, he's holding it near his root chakra. So this is somebody that's showing you, like, I'm not just here for sex. Like, I'm here to actually, you know, to, to, to offer you something. I've got a proposal for you, Okay. So this is somebody who's definitely trying to prove themselves to you. Also, this could be somebody from the past that wants to try and prove that they're um they're on a different wavelength now, I just heard, okay? Could be dealing with a um 
Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn. The star card has come out. So for some of you, you definitely could be dealing with an Aquarius or somebody that definitely wants to heal a situation with, with you. But again, it's clarified in the row of I am able to manifest my heart's desire. So like I said, some of you are definitely, um, I'm hearing hope and um, hope is being restored and your wishes are being granted so if you've been wishing upon a star it's definitely going to come it could be an aquarius okay so this is really really gorgeous also again there's definitely somebody that's um really hoping and praying and wishing for you now if this isn't somebody from the past like i said it's a new person that is kind of scripted what they want and you basically obtain the attributes of what this person wants okay but this is really, really gorgeous. For some of you, you could be in the limelight or you could be dating a celebrity or you will be dating a celebrity or you'll be dating somebody that's um going to be in the public's eye or that's going to make you famous. Okay. Or this is just how somebody sees you. They see you as somebody who outshines the rest with the star and Oshun energy. That's really, really beautiful. You sparkle. I'm hearing sparkly eyes as well or sparkly hair. Maybe some of you have really beautiful, shiny hair. Okay, yeah, the three of pentacles. I told you this person puts you on a pedestal, literally. Literally. This person is here to want to adore you. Look at how she's holding her. Like, this person sees you shine. This is all they see. You could be um, someone who wraps their hair. That could be very significant, but does not have to be, okay? But this is definitely somebody who wants to work with you or work something out with you or somebody that you're going to be working with, okay? Heavy earth energy here with Aquarian, yeah. And then we've got the Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So like I said, there's definitely somebody that um you're going to need to walk away from. And under the Five of Cups, we've got the Ace of Cups demonstrating new love here, okay? So, you know, somebody's heart is going to be broken. Also, again, somebody is upset over a loss. So someone is just realising that they've lost out on a good one, okay? But let's just see. So... Let's clarify the King of Pentacles. That was real quick, wasn't it? The Chariot. So it could be dealing with a Cancer. Okay, but gorgeous. The Emperor drives the Chariot. <laughs> so somebody is coming to you. And you're going to ride off into the sunset. Or um, somebody may want to take you on a trip. Okay, you may be driving for quite a few hours. Or somebody wants to drive to come and see you. Also, again, somebody, some of you could be... um dating somebody who's got like high rankings or they're just in a high field like whatever they work in or they could be like a police officer okay or somebody that i'm hearing like a truck driver or a um um like an uber driver or somebody that does deliveries i'm hearing because he kind of looks like he's got something there like he's got orders to fulfill and he's got two different paths to go in but somebody definitely wants to take you somewhere okay so that's really gorgeous energy. Please clarify the star. Okay, two cards wanted to come out. I just want one. Please clarify the star. Yeah, okay, we've got the judgment card again. So again, answering your calling. Okay, I feel like your, um, your soulmate or the person who you're supposed to be with is kind of like they've been reincarnated within this time. Like the, the divine is calling them out because the divine can hear you manifesting. Okay? So it's like, this is the divine and the divine's like, okay. Also, again, like I said, this is somebody from the past wanting to come back. So somebody wants to reach out to you. They want to call you, okay? Somebody also sees you as somebody who is of divinity. Okay, so just take what resonates. So it could be an Aquarius that wants to heal a situation with you. Or I just keep on hearing Aquarius and Scorpio and Leo. Okay, yeah. And then we've got the Four of Cups at the bottom of the deck. No, the Four of Cups are wanting to come out and the Two of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Beautiful energy, okay? So, yeah, the Four of Cups. So, like I said, somebody, um, they didn't see the blessing that was being offered to them. And now this person is feeling dissatisfied, disinterested. Somebody also feels like, um, you know, you, you, you saw who they really were because you're a Pisces. You know, you can read people to filth, okay? And so somebody may feel like you're not going to be accepting of their offer, okay? Do they want to come back on the Michael Jackson flex? Like, do you remember the time when we fell in love? Do you? And you're just like, no. I, do you remember the time when, you know, you took me for a dickhead and I had to walk away? Do you remember that? Okay. And like I said, some of you are walking away and this is what you're walking right into. Your divine counterpart, the two of cups. Well, I feel like an ex person is going to be there just watching and hating. Okay. Again, some of you could be scripting and scribing what you want, asking for the universe, doing your affirmations. Okay. But um, yeah, I definitely feel like you have to walk away from something in order to bring something beautiful and something new in. Um, I do feel like if this is an ex that reaches out, you may ignore them, 
okay and focus on moving forward into victory and success because this is what you're going after somebody who's going to be loyal and who's going to take care of you okay um so let's get some additional information and additional messages for my beautiful pisces heavy water sign energy here though and heavy earth okay so this card wanted to come out it says um choice yeah so some of you may have a decision between two people two offers or you've got a choice to walk away from the past or just let the past go so if it's not walking away physically it could mean energetically as well it says worry less about making the right choice and more about being strong enough to handle and any outcome yeah so it's just about trusting the universe and trusting that yeah look at the bottom of the deck we've got success here trusting and being optimistic with the optimism card that um you're going to make the right decisions for yourself but not being attached on who it's going to be where it's going to be where's this love going to come from just know that the love is going to come okay so let's get another card this is for my beautiful pisces okay look she's on a path and she's walking and what is she walking right into it says i am a receiver of wisdom guidance love and strength for my journey yeah so you know again with that that leo energy like you're receiving this but again, it, she just looks like she's walking. She's walking away, but she's walking into this. So this is really, really beautiful, okay? This is being confident that you are that you know that you're going to receive the love that you deserve, okay? It says, I am deserving of taking time out to do the things I love. I just said deserve it. It says, I'm deserving. Oh, my God. <laughs> but yes. So again, some of you had to restrict your energy to focus on yourself. Maybe you focused on your look. You just changed certain things. You could have threw out certain things that you felt was attracted to um negative energy or negative things that kept do you know what i mean and, and 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 it's working for you okay it's working with that i am calm and relaxed just relax just relax okay and then we'll get one additional card for my beautiful pisces okay we've got divine feminine that wanted to flip over gorgeous i told you you are divine okay and you to me you are perfect and beauty oh beauty beauty divine feminine energy here people divine feminine energy so you're beautiful you're powerful and you're strong you're you're unique you're natural somebody's gonna love you um for who you truly are sorry freckles could be very significant to you as well you may have freckles on your face or beauty marks you can see she's got like beauty marks there okay but someone thinks you're absolutely gorgeous i feel like the past person is just gonna have to watch you be beautiful and gorgeous Wow, this new person is going to spoil you. Okay, this is gorgeous energy. Thank you so much. Um, if you felt like the reason resonated, please do not hesitate to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And for anything else, all info is down below. Toodles!